What is up YouTube? That's it here bringing you guys an extra special singles video singles is requested a lot on this channel Actually, I know we predominantly upload VGC But a lot of people really do like singles and I personally like playing a lot of singles So I figured why not make some singles content? We're still using some of our favorite Pokemon like uh, like Sock like Gigalith But we're also gonna be using a little bit of Espeon today Espeon is one of my favorite evolutions and that's where I'm gonna direct you guys to the question of the day and that is what is your favorite evolution? And it's a two-part question. Would you guys be interested in playing in an evolution only? So I guess you'd use like Espeon, Umbreon, Vaporeon, Flareon, Jolteon, Glaceon, Leafeon, and Eevee as well. If you can only use those Pokemon, would you be interested in a tournament featuring only those Pokemon? Where everyone else also featured only those Pokemon and where the winner got a cash prize? And would you be interested in that if it was free to enter? Let me know what you guys think about that in the comments below because one might be coming your way a little bit sooner than you think. For those of you guys, for those of you guys that don't actually know, we enter, or sorry, we host free tournaments weekly on my Twitch channel at twitch.tv slash that's a plus one, where we stream pretty much five to six days a week and usually on Fridays or Saturdays, we hold the tournament for people to enter. And I was thinking it'd be kind of fun to host one that only used Eevee. So if you guys are interested in said tournament, uh, let me know. Let me know in the comments below and let me know what format you want it to be. Do you want it to be singles like this video? Or do you want it to be doubles? Because I think doubles could make it be just a little bit spicier. But other than that, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, just like yesterday's video, there will be a paste in for this team in the description of this video. So go nuts. I feel this team is not the best singles team in the world. It relies a lot on Haxorus and Espeon. But it also does have the, uh, you know, the Gigalith and the Sock action. So hopefully you guys like it. We'll be playing some VGC tomorrow. But other than that, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys bright and early tomorrow morning. Sock's good. Um, Barathorn's good. Haxorus is okay. I actually like Haxorus a decent amount here. It outspeeds a lot of those. I just don't think you want to lead with it. I think you want to lead with something that helps check the Excadrill. If I lead like Ferrothorn Haxorus, I'd have to bring something that can switch into soak damage. I think I want to just lead Espeon then. What does Espeon have that. Oh, fuck, I'm just going to lead Espeon. I don't care. Let's just try these three. Choice Band Sock, the only sock? Yeah! I have toilet paper at my house. I'll be fine. That's a hard team to beat, though. Like, Umbreon's hard to beat. Uh, Dragapult, probably a little bit difficult. Dragapult's a pin. Like, we're pinned hard if you leads Dragapult. I will see. I think Sock and Gigalith are making this way too difficult. Because they're both the same Pokemon. <laughs> but they're not good in singles. Sock's okay, but, like, Gigalith is, like, really hard to carry here. I can't just bring Gigalith. Why not play fighting games some days to get a break? Oh, because I have to do this game to pay my bills. That's why. I'm going to go for the big damage. Fighting Grimmsnarl? I'll fight Grimmsnarl. You going to Thunder Wave me, Chi? Yeah, people don't sub if I play other games. Trick! What are you going to give me? Wagon tail? Take my choice specs. They're yours. Do I trick him back? I'm just going to dazzle him against fine. Have I played tournament Pokken? Yeah, I've played a lot of Pokken. Is Elothrad not subbed? Never lucky. Decent money. I'm sure to Wikiberry. No, you don't. You have my you have my choice specs. <laughs> okay, hold on. He has my choice specs. You're gonna switch to something that minimizes that. You're gonna switch to Exadrill, and you're gonna give me your item, and you're gonna take my lagging tail. Switch, 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 switch. Give me your item and take this lagging tail. <laughs> oh man, let's go. Give me those lefties, Chief. That's right. Pokemon's definitely worth getting. What am I getting? 
Assault vest. Yeah, buddy. Let's go. <laughs> you got a useless. You got a choice. You got a choice specs grim snarl and a lagging tail rotom. How you feeling, chief? How you feeling over there? I mean, you got a light screen. Probably feeling okay. Have you tried Legends of Runeterra? No, I haven't. He's withdrawing. You know, back into Grim Snarl. Are you gonna take the salt vest and give me back my specs, please? That was a smart. That was a smart play. Did you do it again? Trick? Is he giving me back my specs? I've never been to Japan. No. I will take my specs back. By the way, he's like, I can't have him having the assault vest. I'll take it. Why Salt Vest over the Scarf on Rotom? Assault Vest because you're not using Trick with Rotom. Yeah, Trickery. The Trick's on him. Don't Trick the Trick Master. There's the Rotom with the Lagging Tail. Now, he gave me back my specs. He's like, this is fine. Oh, I still only use Dazzling Gleam. That's still fine. We're El Spexo. That's a lot of damage. Shadow. Okay, a Shadow Ball still. Alright, that's that's not fine. I hope I don't die. Alright, I'm gonna switch. Because, like, we're still pretty useful. Oh, we had a light screen up. I can't switch. I need to stay in here. Yo, gifting a sub to Elithrad. Yo, Elithrad. Earning the big subs. You love to see it. Fixed it. Elithrad getting the big sub. Let's put some subs up. Thank you so much. Espeon finally goes down. I think you want to bring Haxorus in here. You don't want to show the sock until the end. Until you see the white of their eyes. I love Espeon. Yeah, Espeon's awesome. Espe awesome. No flyers. Yes, it's fine. EQ time. Let's rock and roll. He's thinking. He's got he's got a thinking cap on right now. Got that big EQ. Now what does he have in the back? Is it pulp? Is it Umbreon? I hope it's Umbreon. Oh, it's Umbreon! Yo, we got sock in the back. We got sock back to reality. I just go Dynamax and win the game. He's probably just going to run. No running, huh? Not today. Wait, so Lear, you're actually like first in the tournament right now? Yo, all I can say is you're welcome. Because I would have won that game. I still had like a Dust Cops in the back with like Ally Switch Trick Room and all the shenanigans. Big Max Warm win. Should do over half. Yeah, a little bit over half. Work was stressing you out. Yo, don't get stressed. Foul play. Big foul play. Why does Grimstall not earn switcheroo? I mean, it, it just gets tricked. And the big Max Worm. We win! The trick is on him. The joke's on you. We take those big wins. I didn't even need my sock. That was a fun game. Dragon attacks are pretty okay, but there's two fairies. Looks like we need the power of... I mean, he's going to probably go Dragapult. I don't know if he's going to lead with it. I think I'm going to lead with uh, Gigalith. Gigalith's good. I think you still want the Haxorus. And then I'm looking at Toxapex, actually, because Toxapex is okay for a Dragovish. It's okay for... Some of those. I don't want to disrespect the Rhyperia, though. I think I'm going to go Ferrothorn, even though I know for a fact there's, like, two mons back there that check the Ferrothorn, being the Togekiss and the Dragapult, which are probably both coming, but if I can use the Ferrothorn to, like, weave in on, like, stuff that we resist, it'd be pretty good. It might be a VGC team with, like, all choice items and stuff. Like a super aggro VGC team.
All right, let's see. What are you working with? Dragapult? Togekiss lead, okay. That works for me. That definitely works for me. You can't proc my weakness policy. You're useless. I could. I think I want to Dynamax here. Because, like, Togekiss actually has big struggle with Gigalith. He's like, ah, fuck. <laughs> it's a Gigalith. And I'm like, I know. I know. He's withdrawing. He's going to go into his Rhyperior, I think. Oh, okay. That's fine. You might die. I don't think he's dead. He definitely might be dead. But I think he is probably going to be alive. I'm thinking he might be dead after like two hits. So if like I hit him, set sand, sand hits, and then max guard, he might be dead. I don't know if I crit. We'll see. Drago is bulky. It's a neutral one too. So it's like, eh, he's probably alive. But I wish he died. Please go away. Nope, I'm right. See? I think. Let me actually think if I should max guard this. Let me actually look at how much damage they actually take. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna try it. Oh, shit, I'm on max guard! That sucks. I think it's actually better just to do this. I know I'm, I'm, I'm wasting my Dynamax, but, like, I'm, I'm, I'm cool with this. The Gigalith checks the Togekiss. Like, it just checks it. Togekiss ain't got nothing. It sucks I wasted my Dynamax. Yep. But I did set the sun. Sorry, the sand. And that's actually pretty important for breaking sashes. So it's like, it's not super bad. I want to see if it's Dragapult coming in here now. Or like, Togekiss again. Stoke is he's just gonna go for a heat wave and I'll switch back in my Gigalith. Rhyperior. Okay, yeah, this is great for me. I think you just leech seed it. So we're not gonna proc his weakness policy. That'd be foolish. Oh shit! Why do they always have fire punch? What's up with all these weird ass mons getting fire punch? I think he needed that crit, by the way. I really think the crit was 100% needed. Would Rock Blast be better fit than Stone Edge on Gigalith? No, I like... Uh, no, I, I don't think Rock Blast is good. Because it stales badly. I'm going to EQ, I think. He's going to Dynamax it, though. And so the way he's going to go down is... I hope that I could Oko with this. Might be better to Superpower, actually. I think, it, I think I'm going to Superpower. It's a little bit stronger. Because I'll be at plus two. Here's the EQ. Weakness policy's up, chief! The thing that sucks is... Togekiss is gonna Dynamax and beat our Haxorus. Because he's down. I'm actually think about... Exactly what I need to do. Yeah, right here has been having fire punch. It's just really weird to see it, that's all. Last turn sandstorm. That's actually okay with me. He should not Dynamax this turn, but he might Dynamax to get an Airstream boost. Which would be actually like pre poggers. I don't think I win this one, this game. If he especially if he airstreams here. If he airstreams at all, I don't think I win. Because then Haxorus doesn't get two hits. If I still had my Dynamax, I think I could have won. But obviously, I didn't. I don't have it. So, Starfall. Okay. Yeah, that works. He didn't die. He didn't do the Airstream. So, I get two hits. And the first hit can lower defense, which I think I need. this 
Like, I just have to go for Iron Tail. Like, if I Dragon Dance here, that is not the sauce. Let's go. If the Airstream's here, we just lose. If I get a defense drop here... Oh! Are you Airstreaming or not? We just policy, don't give a shit. You need to Airstream right now. We, we can win! If we hit this Iron Tail, we win! I think. That defense drop was huge. Come on. Come on. Let's go, let's go. 75? 100%. Oh! Oh my goodness! Coming back! <laughs> Yo! Never heard of Airstream, huh? Give me that win, yo! Woo! He don't miss! Iron Tail better than Max Steel Spike? I don't have any fire attacks, but I have a big sock. I'm gonna leave with it. Why not, right? What are they gonna do? What are you gonna do? I think you still gotta bring the Haxorus. I think you should still bring Ferrothorn, but I think Ferrothorn's like... The Ferrothorn mirror match... That's a dangerous game. Someone's got to play. Dark Pulse on Rotom's pretty bad. Um, on most Rotom sets. It's weaker than like a stabbed whatever move. Like a Hydro Pump. It's weaker than a stabbed Hydro Pump. Even a super effective Dark Pulse is weaker than a stabbed Hydro Pump. That's oh, a military thing. Never look. I was checking out something. I've been dehydrated and disoriented from moving and needed to drink like three bottles of water and chill. Wow. You're thirsty. Okay. Speaking about the next team that I was going to build, speaking about thirsty, I think I want to build that. We saw someone the other day in yesterday's stream that had like the vested Raichu with weakness policy Lapras and then like Woody Colo. I'm going to build that. That sounds really fun. You know what else sounds fun? Destroying this Pokemon. You got any ghost types? Gonna wish you did. You better not switch into that Sylveon, Chief. You will die. You will go away. I wonder if he's thinking of... Like, I, I guess, like, Mole Breaker would have activated. But look at the sock. Look back at... Look at the sock. Now back to me. Your Pokemon's gone. Where'd it go? That's... Oh, is he really switching to Sylveon? I'm gonna two-shot it. He is! You're gonna... Oh my gosh, it's gone. <laughs> Yo, I'm about to PP out of close combat. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's so big. That's so big, right? Am I wrong? That's freaking huge damage to a Sylveon, guys. He's thinking like, why is this my life? Quick attack, never lucky. Yo, he knows. He knows. Down for the count. That's a banded sock, yo. That's right. Big sock damage. If he didn't have quick attack, he would have been in for a banned time. Alright, so the Hydreon's probably going to come back out now. I think I'm going to stay in with sock, because it's going to force him to use, like... Oh, that thing. Okay. You think that thing's scarfed? At the very least, like, there's no other reason for me to, like, do anything else with this sock, so, like... Let's just do damage. We one shot at a Gujar with it yesterday. With the choice ban. And what's you gonna do? You think I'm gonna switch? I don't even know. What is Sock's base speed? Is it like 70? 75? We'll see who's faster. At the very least, he like this forces him to like go Dynamax. And it wastes the turn off his Dynamax, so I can just come in with a big Haxorus. Who knew Sock was an absolute beast? Sox 85? So good! I think I outspeed then. I mean, I'm adamant. So, like, he'd have to be jolly. He'd have to be jolly. I'd love to hit him in the face. Hitting him in the face! Oh, the face! <laughs> Not the face. <laughs> Not the face! What's your favorite competitive mon? Um, 
Hmm. Because, like, Butterfree is technically competitive in this game. But, like, I don't know. Butterfree might not be... Probably Garchomp. Big sock damage. That's right. That's right. I think it's actually better just to Dynamax and go for the Oko. Sock's so good. Guys, do we need to make a sock emote? I would totally use a sock emote for just flexing on fools. Yeah, sock, sock gets sturdy. That's pretty much what it comes down to. What's your that's right notification from? I say that all the time. It's from um, it's from a regional video. Someone can link it. It's from me competing at regionals. It's from the casters casting one of my games. Hydragon's the last mon. Are you sashed or scarfed? You're gonna Dynamax. It might be Habanberry. He's probably sashed then. We're faster than he is. Means must be modest. Oh, he's just gone. Yo, I'll take I'll take the sock win. Sock won me the game. That guy tried to use Sylveon, and I'm like, what now? Defeated. Wasted out on Route One.